U.S. Citizenship Test, 100 Civics Questions and Easy Answers, Newest 2021 Version. 1. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. 2. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. 3. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. 4. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. 5. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. 6. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. 7. How many amendments does the Constitution have? 27. 8. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announced our independence from Great Britain. 9. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty. 10. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. 11. What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalist economy. 12. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. 13. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. 14. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. 15. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. 16. Who makes federal laws? Congress. 17. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. 18. How many U.S. Senators are there? 100. 19. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? 6. 20. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answers will vary. 21. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. 22. We elect a U.S. Representative for how many years? 2. 23. Name your U.S. Representative. Answers will vary. 24. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. 25. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because they have more people. 26. 
We elect a president for how many years? Four. Twenty-seven. In what month do we vote for president? November. Twenty-eight. What is the name of the president of the United States now? Joe Biden. Twenty-nine. What is the name of the vice president of the United States now? Kamala Harris. Thirty. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. Thirty-one. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. Thirty-two. Who is the commander in chief of the military? The president. Thirty-three. Who signs bills to become laws? The president. Thirty-four. Who vetoes bills? The president. Thirty-five. What does the president's cabinet do? Advises the president. Thirty-six. What are two cabinet level positions? Vice president. Secretary of Agriculture. Thirty-seven. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Thirty-eight. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. Thirty-nine. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Forty. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Visit USCIS.gov/citizenship/testupdates for the name of the Chief Justice of the United States. Forty-one. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. Forty-two, under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Give a driver's license. Forty-three, who is the governor of your state now? Answers will vary. Forty-four, what is the capital of your state? Answers will vary. Forty-five. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. Forty-six. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic. Forty-seven. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Visit uscis.gov/citizenship/testupdates for the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives. Forty-eight. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens eighteen and older can vote. Forty-nine. What is one responsibility? That is only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Fifty. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Fifty-one. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States?
freedom of expression, freedom of speech. 52. What do we say loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. 53. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Obey the laws of the United States. 54. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? 18 and older. 55. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote. Run for office. 56. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. 57. When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18, between 18 and 26. 58. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. 59. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. 60. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. 61. Why did the colonists fight the British? because of high taxes. 62. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. 63. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4th, 1776. 64. There were 13 original states. Name three. New York, Virginia, Georgia. 65. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. 66. When was the Constitution written? 1787. 67. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison. 68. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? Started the first free public libraries. 69. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. Who was the first president? George Washington. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? Louisiana. 72. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Civil War. 73. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. 74. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. 75. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Free the slaves. 76. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Free the slaves. 
77. What does Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. 78. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War I. 79. Who was president during World War I? Wilson. 80. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Roosevelt. 81. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. 82. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. 83. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. 84. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights. 85. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights. 86. What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. 87. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Lakota. 88. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Mississippi. 89. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific. 90. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic. 91. Name one U.S. territory. Guam. 92. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. 93. Name one state that borders Mexico. New Mexico. 94. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. 95. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. 96. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. 97. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because each star represents a state, and there are 50 states. 98. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. 99. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. 100. Name two national U.S. holidays. Thanksgiving, Christmas.